Welcome back to Empowerment Nursing. I'm Ashley, a nurse educator, and you are tuning into our weekly application of In the Know, where we make it simple. Please comment your response below and then press play on the video to listen to the correct answer and rationale. Our question this week is as follows. The charge nurse on a medical unit is creating the assignment. Incoming staff consists of a licensed practical nurse, also called an RPN, registered nurses, and unlicensed assistive personnel, also called UAP or PSWs. When reviewing the charge nurse's assignment, which is the most appropriate? So this comes down to a management and delegation style question. Who are you going to assign to who? A, assign the PSWs to complete the AM care. B, assign the RNs to do all sterile procedures. C, assign the RPNs to write the nursing care plans. Or D, assign the RPNs to give all the IV medications. So let's first rule out some of these possible answers. We'll go from the bottom up. D, assigning the RPNs to give all of the IV medications. That is incorrect because only qualified RNs on the NCLEX exam can give the full scope of IV medications. It's not specifying what the drug is. Um, so that is not the correct answer. We can cross out D. I'm going to cross it out too. C, assign the RPNs to write the nursing care plans. That is completely incorrect. Only registered nurses or RNs are qualified to write nursing care plans. RPNs can carry those out. So C is incorrect. B, assign the RNs to do all sterile procedures. The key word there being all. Yes, obviously RNs can do sterile procedures, but RPNs can also do some sterile procedures. So it's not correct that you have to assign the RNs to do all of the sterile procedures. So that is also wrong. That leaves A, our correct answer, which is assign the UAP or PSWs to complete the AM care. Here's a disclaimer to that. This isn't specifying anything further than that. For, so for the purposes of this question, A is our correct answer. However, I want you to remember that if there is a patient who is unsafe for a PSW to complete AM care on, such as a freshly post-op patient, um, a fresh um, stroke patient, PSWs would not be completing AM care on anybody who's unstable that way. So keep that in mind. Um, just for future reference. And for the answer to all this question, um, all this question, for the answer to this question and all the questions related to your registration exam, you can check out our complete study packages on our website, www.n-powermentnursing.com. Um, we guarantee you'll pass or your money back. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you next time on In the Know.